Hey everyone, Tech Steve here, and this is the Mars Pro 4K projector that has all the goodies that I know you're looking for when it comes to technology. You can play your own files on a hard drive. It even has a game mode. So in this video, I'm gonna show you guys everything you need to know. Let's get into it. The Mars Pros is a DLP projector with a brightness of 3200. It uses laser technology for better clarity, and it has a lifespan up to 30,000 hours. Besides the light source, it even has multiple sensors on it so it can reflect off the screen that you're using to make automatic adjustments. On the left-hand side, there's an outlet for the built-in fan to keep it cool. And on the right-hand side is where the cooling fan is located, plus there's speakers inside. There's plenty of connections with a headphone jack, two USBs, two HDMI and one's eARC for a soundbar. You also have a fiber optic and a ethernet input to hook it directly to a router and Wi-Fi is built in. There's a remote control that comes with it. On the top, you can find your power plus a indicator. There's also a mouse. There's a navigation key with the OK, a back button, home button, menu button, and volume. In the box, you get this 18 volt power supply, a cleaning cloth, and it also includes this multiple language user's manual. If you set it on the table, it does come with these adjustable screws so you can move them around. And there's a screw hole right here so you can mount it on some type of tripod as well. Now, even though I'm using a basic 100 inch screen, I will tell you that movies look great on it. Let me show you what I'm talking about. This projector also has a capacitive power off and on, and it does have a sensor that picks up the light in the room if you want it to automatically adjust itself. Now, I would tell you whenever you're using a 100 inch screen, I used a tape measure when I actually filmed the previous part of this video, and the projector was nine feet away, but it can go up to 150 inch if you still want to get clarity, but you have to go up to 4.2 meters away if you have the space in your room. Now using the automatic adjustments works pretty good around the box, but just in case it doesn't line up the way you want it, the software lets you go in there and manually adjust all the corners so you can get the screen to fit properly and get the best viewing experience. Now I didn't know what to expect, but I will tell you that this projector gets excellent contrast ratio. As you can see here, it's pulling up the full scale. Addition to that, it does have great uniformity. And it has another technology built in called MEMC that allows you to adjust the motion so you can make sure that everything is smooth when watching sports, playing video games, or anything that has a lot of fast action. Not only does this projector have a gaming mode, but it has an input lag of 20 milliseconds, which is pretty good. If you play your Xbox or PS5, you're definitely gonna be happy with the response. And I got a chance to go through some of the settings and see how it performs, and I played some games. In 4K mode, you can get up to 60 hertz, but if you drop it down to 1080p, you can get a blistering fast 120 frames per second. Plus it supports your auto low latency, your variable refresh rates, HDR10, and it does support HLG picture profile as well, but it does not support Dolby Vision. You really are one of a kind now. So I showed you guys some gameplay, but honestly, when the camera turned off, I played Dirt 5. I played a lot of games that I just generally like, and it actually did a really good job. I was very impressed how responsive it was. The colors were great. And on top of that, it had a really good audio system. So if you're looking for something that's all in one, the speakers on there are not too bad. You can hear all the voices for dialogue and you can hear all the rumble in the bass. But of course, a sound bar or headphones gonna give you a better experience. Now having a projector has some pros and cons. And what I mean by this is when it comes to light. So I want to show you guys what the projector looks like in a complete dark room. And then I toggled on the light I did it back and forth. And as you can see, it does have a decent picture when there's a lot of light in the room. But of course, a darker room is going to give you the best picture quality. Now, speaking of picture quality, I want to show you guys some more demos and show you how well the colors actually perform. I also want to check out HDR. So I played some demos on it. And as you can see, that 3200 brightness is definitely bringing out all the details in it. So if you're the type of person that's going to be watching movies, watching sports, or even doing some gaming, 
I definitely know you're going to be happy with the results as long as you have the proper lighting. I also like the fact that the Mars Pro will show you a demo whenever you're adjusting your picture. So whenever you're going through your different profiles, you can see exactly what it's going to look like. And additional to that, it also does that for the motion as well. And I was very impressed with how many features this projector actually have. Under the community tab, you can actually download an app store and inside of there, you can get access to all the popular applications that you know and love. You can also go into the menu and customize your own wallpaper, which a lot of people want to do on TVs, but you can't. I even plugged in this hard drive and I was able to play my own files. Plus it will connect to NAS servers and stream directly. And you can cast from your iPhone or use Miracast to cast from your Android device. And there's even a web browser built right in that you can use to surf the web or go to some of the most popular sites out there. And when it comes to settings, you can go through the menu and adjust everything that you can think about. You have Adobe Digital as well as DTS support. You also have sound profiles. You have different movie profiles. You also can go in here and adjust it if you're mounting it on a ceiling upside down. You can make adjustments for that. And the fact that it has automatic focusing and correction is definitely going to make everything easy. So film in this video, I want to put this Mars Pro through the test and I would tell you that it's very snappy. I didn't see any kind of lag in the menu system and it worked pretty much flawless when it comes to that. And that's because this projector has four gigabytes of DDR4 memory and a whopping 128 gigabytes of built-in internal storage. So you can customize it, upload things into it. You can make it your own. Now it retails for $1,799 and I think it's a good deal because if you get the right screen, you can have up to 200 inches, far less than a television if you have the right room. Now, if you're interested, I'll leave the links in the description below. I'm Tech Steve. Thanks a lot for watching and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace. Tech Steve.